God bless all big people. I love y'all. I really, really do. You know what I'm saying? My grandma's big boned. She don't got no shoes with the shoelaces. She got them, uh, she don't wear slides, okay? She just got the, the slip-ins. She just slip her foot in and she just walk to where she about to sit down at. Because she don't like standing up for too long. You know the vibes. It's Jay. Hand me the lighter, I'm about to get litter than a bitch. Big, big period. Are you serious? These hoes are acting all delirious and I ain't... You know the vibes. It's Jay. What's going on, Jay Squad? Plum Squad, it's your girl Jay. You already know. Welcome back to Jay Vibes. There's a whole lot of great vibes going on, big period. And I am back with a reaction video. You already know. If it ain't the littest, it's the realest, big period. Today's video, you guys, is coming from Us Outsiders YouTube channel, is it? No, it's not, because Red has her own YouTube channel. This is actually coming from I Am Red, which is Red from Us Outsiders. This is her personal YouTube channel. This video is called Top 10 Things to Know About Big Girls. You know, Red is a comedian. She's so funny. And I just really am curious to know what do we need to know as big girls because ain't no discrimination you know i like them big small medium smarge i just like them how they come okay if, if it's a woman i just like them how they are okay come as you are and come as you please but please <laughs> Please make sure you are subscribed to my channel. Please make sure you give this video a like, comment down below, share this video, and let's get into it. Before I say something that's crazy, alright, let's get it. Is it Luda? So really, I shouldn't even have to turn it down, but I want y'all to hear me. It's me, it's you, oh yes, it's we. It's us, it's the ones that they got to see. It's me, it's you, oh yes, it's we. Sit back, get back, and love with shit. I love it. Mm. <laughs> y'all don't even know why I even came up with that. Oh, look at my noodles. They sticking together because I took so long to record it. Uh-uh. I oh can't eat noodles in a cup. But it ain't nothing to put these pickles in there to get it a little more weather. Uh-uh. You know what I'm saying? However, it's been a long time coming. I'm I'm doing a little homemade goulage too, y'all. I'm telling y'all on my main channel, y'all already know I done put y'all up on speed. Why I told you you gotta get your pickles and noodles. I get chill bumps just saying it because I just I don't know. I don't, I don't. I've never. A cup of noodles. You get your um, hamburger pickles. Get you some motherfucking Cheeto and eat it together because it's so good. I don't understand. What really helps it out though is the pickle. It's most definitely the pickle. But <laughs> oh my god! Did you say it, Grace? He's so stale. Oh, <laughs> oh geez, that's why I always get too bad. You ain't right there, but you stale. Oh my god, that hurts. Oh my goodness. Yeah, this this one of my little favorite drinks. I be getting out of Dollar General. It's so much better. When it looks like, thick. Real, real cold, like out the freezer, call oh, y'all. It's so much better. It looks thick, but it is a smoothie. But it's V8 Splash smoothie and it's strawberry banana. Let me see if I can. Oh. Yeah, right yeah. It's strawberry banana, y'all. It is so good. Like, I'm a girl that likes strawberry banana anyway. <laughs> I love some strawberry But, y'all, I am back with another story time. I think my, my channel going to be with... Mixed with story times, challenges. I don't know if I'm going to do pranks on this channel because it's like, who am I going to prank? Like, that got to be thought out. And I don't be with it. I don't be with all that. But I don't know. But you know what? This one here, this actually, this is not a story time. Oh, this is. This is not a story time, actually. 
this is just an informative video for you. <laughs> Let's get into know it. About when it comes to be girls. Okay. <laughs> I get you know. Uh-uh, Red. Right. You got to get it down for this. But, listen. So, basically, to me, these are the top 10 things you need to know when it comes to a big girl, whether it's dating her, being in a, and you know, friendship with her, whatever. How you see, I was a different type of big girl. I ain't gonna lie, y'all, because I ain't care. I knew I was one twenty, and you couldn't tell me I couldn't do it. If I wanted to do it, I did it. <laughs> <laughs> big period. What you mean, babe? Hello, hello, there's one by too. Red is very beautiful. I like little bit too. It be little bit mouth for me. No matter her size, even when she was on the Bad Girls Club and I used to watch her. She's always, you know what I'm saying, the life of the party. She's just so full of life. <laughs> In jokes. I just feel like I need to tell y'all this because y'all not understand the seriousness when it comes to them noodles. Being with a big girl. Dating a big girl. Like, it get real. It get real. Oh, right, I got so, my retainer and I can't even eat. Number 10. If I'm on a date with you, especially a nickel. If I'm on a date with you, or I'm in a car with you. I ain't really, we really ain't gonna care when it's our homegirls or our friends. We really only more so gonna care when we around people we really don't know like that or somebody we getting to know like that or that we may like. You get out the car first and then you let us get out the car. Cause when we riding, like our shirt rises, the pins, they, they go down a little bit when you like bend your body to sit down in the car. And it's like, I don't need to be doing this. <laughs> Before getting out of the car, I just need you to get out of the car so that way when I get out of the car, ain't nobody looking right here and then I can just pull up and pull down and get myself together when I get out of the car. Okay? I'm laughing because, uh, I'm laughing. This is why I'm laughing. I'm gonna just keep it 100 with you. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna just be honest. When a big girl is getting out the car, if I do see the crack of your ass before you get out the car, I'm gonna have an attitude because I'm gonna feel like. I'm gonna feel like you about to show your ass. Like literally, you about to show the crack of your ass wherever you about to go. And I don't wanna have that mindset. You know what I'm saying? So, she, I, hell, maybe we do need to get out the car first. That way, that's not even in my mind. You know what I'm saying? That's not even in my mind. That way, if we at a restaurant and the crack of your ass is showing, but to the people behind you, at least I'm not knowing like her ass probably out. You know what I'm saying? I wouldn't even have that mindset because I wouldn't have seen your ass out prior to us getting out. That's a good one, Red. That's a good one. That's a good one. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. I know y'all are like, ooh, yes. Yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> I got this Come waist on. trainer on. It hurt to laugh. <laughs> Don't buy us no clothes. Socks, slippers. That's cute. Lotion, spray, perfume, cool. Don't buy no clothes. All right. Some big girls like they like stretchy pants. You know, some jeans don't fit how you think they fit. One size does not fit all. <laughs> Not with no real people, okay? Uh-uh. 
the two of them ain't gonna work because that means we really it's like getting up off the floor. <laughs> oh. <sighs> I'm sorry. Yeah, two though. It's like getting up off the floor. I'm sorry, Red. <laughs> I'm only laughing. Almost crying. Because let me let me tell you something. I love how big girls, big people, I love how they get off the flow. It just it's so much effort. You know what I'm saying? It's like the two the choo choo train, I think I can, I think I can, I think and you can. And when you get up, you be like, Woof, woo child. You don't wanna get back down. But I love to see a big person get off the flow. Some people roll over. Arch they, I don't know about arching their back, but you know they they it look like they about to pounce on something. Then they gotta put that one knee up. Then they're like, oh nah, they ain't gonna work because you know they got yeah, they got a lot of stuff going on in the front. So then they gotta they gotta use some. They gotta lean over. I just don't know how y'all do it. It's just it's like it's like science. It's like a chemistry class that I failed. But I love to see big people get off the floor. It's just so funny. Alright. Number seven. We prefer slides over sneakers. That is true. We do prefer slides or anything that's like slip ins or whatever. Where it don't involve no shoe strain because then at that point, who gonna time? <laughs> I mean, we just prefer not. <sighs> Bro, as she says these things, I, I see it in my head. You know what I'm saying? You know, some people can get their they foot to cross on their leg like that. Like, some people can get their foot to cross on their leg like that. And then you be wondering why the shoestring on the side. Because... But some people, <sighs> some people gotta tuck their tuck their shoestring because they don't got nobody to tie their shoestrings. <sighs> God bless all big people. I love y'all. I really, really do. You know what I'm saying? My grandma's big boned. She don't got no shoes with the shoelaces. She got them. Uh, she don't wear slides. Okay. She just got the, the slip ins. She just slip her foot in and she just walk. To where she about to sit down at. Because she don't like standing up for too long. And she don't want to be pushing no wheelchair. And she don't want no walker. And she don't want no cane. Go get her a buggy. She going to lean on the buggy. Alright. So don't think that I'm here because I don't, I don't got no big people in my family. I got some big bony people in my family. Everybody do. You should. They're the ones that know how to cook. Yeah. Not to try shoes. That's all I'm saying. A little tucking in here and out. I think a big red video where you tuck in your shoes. <laughs> <laughs> I just I'm said that. Who I feel? <sighs> Number six. I should do a video about slim, thick girls because I'm small, but I've seen smaller. But I should definitely probably do a video. If you think I should do a video about slim, thick girls, small girls, let me just say small girls, okay? Ten things you need to know about small girls. Please make sure you get this video to over a thousand likes and over 500. I'm sorry. Woo, that was pushing it there. Wait a minute. Who are you? Over a thousand views and over 500 likes, and we're going to get into it. We walk about, we don't, we don't really like to walk by a group of people. We don't like to go around a group of people because you already know how ignorant people get. And even though the big girl try to act like she not, oh, she listening to see what you finna say. Mm -hmm. And depending on what kind of big girl you will, you might act like you ain't hear them. Or you gonna turn around and be like, big. What the fuck your funny looking ass at? Even if he fine, girl, like, I'm funny. Like, okay. 
Jadi let's see. Number five. Oh yeah. Mm. I wanted that shit though. That's why I dropped. More than likely when you with a big girl, she's gonna have big girls as her friends. Okay? I mean you gotta make room, okay? You gotta have shit that's gonna hold them. You need to understand that. She will have a big friend. Ooh. And the reason why I'm saying she, I'm not saying us because I was the big girl who always wanted the smaller friends because I don't want to share my shit with y'all. And I don't want to have to end up coming to use your shit. Like, we can't fit each other's stuff. Shit, we be straight. <sighs> and I was always one twenty anyway. Number four. What? One. <laughs> when we have intercourses, we like to do it with the lights off. Or the lights can be off and the TV can be on. I'm just saying, man. Oh, I'm busting that thing open. I don't care if the lights on or off. <laughs> Black dot. Cool. Boy. You gonna be mad you didn't see this physique. You gonna be real mad. Like, real mad. <laughs> anyway. Uh, number three, Red. Number three. No exceptions, turn the lights off. I'm telling y'all. That noodle on her shirt is distracting. You know, it makes big girls feel comfortable when you just accommodate them like that. It should just, it just moves everything to us, okay? <laughs> do it for us. We do it for us. We gon' do it. Hot or hot? hot. Please inform us whether you have stairs or not. I am screaming. Whether well, wherever we going consists of stairs and no elevators. Because at that point, we have to plan <laughs> ahead. How? And I'm not planning. I know y'all laughing. I'm not planning. Why do you think they be like, oh, I stay outside. I sit in the car. Oh, my. Why do you think a big girl could just sit? Because that's what we specialize in. Oh. We can just sit though. You are the stairs off. Oh, FaceTime me, bitch. Uh, girl, I'll tell you what I want. Period. That's all I'm saying. When y'all become big girl friends, y'all take on a little responsibility. You know I ain't gonna go there. You know if I need some of stairs, I'm gonna ask you to go get. So I don't even know why we even at this point. But that's another thing. Another story. Alright. Number two. No walking long distance whatsoever. If I can't pull up to the store and park in front of the store, I ain't doing it. I'm not the type of girl that's going to the mall with you because I ain't walking. I'm telling you not. I ain't walking. See, me, when I go shopping, I go in the store I need to go in and go out the store I need to go out of. <laughs> I ain't no walking. <laughs> See me? I like to go out by the grocery department in Walmart with a self check out. <laughs> but see, I like to go in on the pharmacy side because I'm going to end up on the side where the grocery that is called convenience thing. That's all I'm saying. Oh, we do that too. Everybody. Now, number one. Do what's convenient. Everybody know. Everybody know when it comes to a big girl, what is this? this is always going to be number one. The AC. <laughs> we need the AC. We need air. It don't matter that we just walked out of our house with the AC. As soon as we touch the sun, we sweat. Some big girls may not sweat. Congrats. Congrats. But I have yet to see a big girl that didn't sweat. That's all I'm saying. We sweat. Okay? Ain't no just wiping it off and it's going to open. You done, it done seep between them rolls, them booty cheeks, them scrubby thighs. Y'all already know. Y'all already know. So it's like, you got to stay AC ready. I'm not riding no hot ass car. Only way I'm going to ride the car with no AC is during the winter. During the winter time. <sighs> so, I just wanted to come to y'all and let y'all know from a big girl's Why? 
Why is she like this? Lord Jesus. Ain't no judging over here. I love Red and all of her big girl rules. And all of you big girls out there too, I love you. Somebody loves you, baby. Okay? Oh, oh, oh. Yes, ma'am. Somebody loves you, okay? And I love you. And I hope that you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please make sure you give this video a like, a comment, subscribe down below. Make sure you are subscribed. Did I say that? I don't know if I said that. Let me say it again. These are not braces. This is my retainer because I know y'all asking me down below. Jay, how many times you gonna get braces? Not again. So I'm wearing my retainer like I'm supposed to. Too. And if you got retainers, you probably be wearing, you better make sure you're wearing retainers because your teeth do ship and they do move. It may not happen tomorrow, but you know, tomorrow, one day, two days turn into one month, two months, and then your teeth back, maybe worse. So wear your retainer, alright? I am signing out to the next video. I love you guys. Have a great day. Be blessed. Stay clean. Peace. Nah, I ain't conceited. I'm, I'm a different breed. Catch you slipping, best belief. I don't need no reason. I'ma cut the ties, ho. Turn your wife to my ho. Just focus on you, baby girl. <laughs> J vibes. You know the vibes. You know the fuck going on. And I'm out this bitch.